This tutorial will show you how to install OpenOffice on your computer at home. OpenOffice is a program made by the folks at Sun which is completely free which will allow you to read Word documents and allow you to read the notes that are produced within this class. So to download OpenOffice first go to Internet Explorer and navigate to www.openoffice.org go down to download openoffice.org select download now OpenOffice is free, so uh, you don't have to pay anything for it. Here I got a pop-up blocker, which may well happen to you too. Uh, one way to defeat this is to hold down the control key, which will stop this message from coming up. In this case, I'm going to left-click on it and say download file. Now I'm going to save this to uh, my home directory, which you may or may not have made already, and I'll just save it into there. I'll put it in a folder so I don't forget what it is. I'll call this an open office setup, and go ahead and save this in there. Now, this is going to be a very big download. Um, there are 148 megs that you have to download. So what I'll do is I'll go ahead and um, just wait patiently for this to happen. I'm going to speed up the process a little bit by pausing this demo here. At this point, OpenOffice is just about finished downloading to my personal computer. So after you've waited this long patiently, and it will take quite a while, especially um, if you have a slow connection, um, you should be able to get the file. So it should look about like this as it completes the process. Now once you get to here, please select Run. And again, it'll take a little bit of time for it to do something, so just wait patiently. You'll get a security warning. Go ahead and click Run again. Or at least you may get that. It depends on what the configuration is of your computer. And I'll go ahead and select Next. And then we'll go ahead and select Unpack. Now that we've downloaded the files, we need to install them. So this is the installation wizard for OpenOffice. So as soon as it becomes available, we'll go ahead and uh, we'll begin um, installing the program. At this point, go ahead and click Next, and go ahead and just fill in a username, so I'll just write in my name, and I'll just say this is for my household, and I'll click Next. Let's go ahead and go with the Complete. And we'll 
it'll say put a startup link on the desktop. To uh, run OpenOffice, you do have to have some form of Java installed on your computer, but most people do have this, and OpenOffice should do this for you automatically. Uh, at the beginning of installation, if for some reason you don't have Java on your computer, it may uh, send you off to get it. So just follow the instructions to do that. So at this point, just sit back, just watch what's going on. It's going to be a little bit boring, but we'll get through it. After finishing your installation, you should come to this screen. At this point, click Finish. And it will tell you that you need to restart your computer. Um, at this particular point, your computer is completely programmed for uh, open office, and you should be able to run the program. So I'll go ahead and click Yes. This concludes the tutorial.